But it do, it's your girl, Janice. I know y'all wondering where I've been. <sighs> so, I had been talking, if you've, I mean, if you've been following me for quite a while, y'all already know. Um, so I had this, you know, dream about 18 months ago. Well, maybe a little bit, about 15, 16 months ago. Um, I really sat back and I was like, okay, yeah, I'm a makeup artist. Who's not a makeup Everybody says they're a makeup artist this day. This time and you know, an era. Everybody's a makeup artist. Everybody's a photographer. You know what I'm saying? Yes, I'm retired and I don't have to work, but I want to continue. So what do I want to do that's going to set me, a, you know, set me apart from everybody else? So I decided, okay, I'm going to become an esthetician. I went to school, but before I even went, I said, I'm, I'm only doing this because I want to open my own spa, right? So I did my time in school. I graduated and everything. Still worked, you know, um, work is very good, but I really do enjoy aesthetics. I really do enjoy skincare. Um, and my clients wanted that, you know, they, they want that. They want me to not only, you know, do their makeup, but you know, you know, keep, keep their skin up and going. So I was like, okay, cool. So I was like, okay, go to school, do whatever I want to do. And after I graduated, I had more clientele because the people that I was caring for at school, my clients at school, they were like, look, we don't care how much we have to pay. We like, you know, we like your work. You know, you keep our skin right. You need your own spot. I didn't work, for, I don't want, once you become a woman of a certain age, you don't want to work for nobody. Especially after you did it for years and you retire, you do not want to work for anybody. For real. I don't want nobody telling me what to do. I don't want to have to make nobody happy. You know who I want to make happy? Me. So I said, what do I want to do? I opened my own salon. I thought, I thought about it, I talked to people about it, and they was like, well, is that was something that you really want to do, whatever, whatever. So I said, okay, I'm going to do it. Um, but the way I want to do it is very exclusive. Um, and that's what I'm doing. So on, uh, for a while, if you've been watching me, I was complaining because I could not find any space. Um, a good friend of mine thought about me and she let me know where I could find a place. And it is, it's a great, it's a great place. Um, it's pr um, private practice size, not too, you know, crazy, you know, exclusive clients. You know, you don't want nothing too big where you got everybody and their mama trying to come up in there, you know, bonquisha or, you know, whatever. It's, it's, a, it's exclusive clientele. That's just how I'm, that's, I mean, I ain't knocking on nobody else's hustle, but there's 50 more, you know, 50 million in places around here. You know what I'm saying? So it is a wax bar. Okay. I specialize in body waxing, but I do have the skincare thing going on and I do have the makeup going on and I do makeup classes once a month. Um, I'm excited. I'm very excited. Um, I'm a little, you know, sick to my stomach sometimes because I'm doing this all with my saving, you know, with my own little ducats, my, my coin girl, my coin. And I think I am a little bit more serious about it because I'm doing it with my money. I think if I would have got a loan from the bank where they kind of tell you what you got to do and, you know, I ain't got time for that. I, I got a problem with people telling me what to do. So it's all mine. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I knew what I wanted to do. I saved for it and I went for it and I'm happy. Um, after this video, would I talk about it a little bit? If you go to my blog channel, I'll probably will. I think I will blog that whole process. We start with construction pretty soon and looking for, um, I'm looking for a nail tech. I don't want like a whole bunch of people working with me because I do, I do have bipolar disorder and I can be a bia. So I don't need too many personalities I need to work with. You know what I'm saying? Cause I can be, uh, and 
I will tell you my faults, and that is my fault. I am, I'm not a, I'm not, I'm not like that. It's just that I like things my way. I have that type A personality. That's why my husband is perfect for me because he can deal with that. Not everybody can deal with that. Some people think that I'm being bossy or, which at that point is, that's what I am. But imagine that on 10, because my coin is on the line. <laughs> so yeah, I, I cannot, and I can't work with, you know, close friends because, you know, being my friend and working, that's two totally things, two totally different things and I can be a real, yeah, but other than that, everything is great. I've just been really busy and a little stressed, you know. But other than that, everything is great. I will start blogging like I said I was going to start blogging because I have a blogging channel. Um, it's Johnny's Glamazon Gardener. I'll make sure I put the link down in the description box below. But I'm going to keep it 100 with you. I when you do blogs they're really up close and personal you see what i'm saying and i and what i've noticed with me is you either like me or you hate me and i feel like when i do a lot of videos like this where i'm talking people don't like me too much but do i really give a damn no i don't but you're gonna see me and how i am every you know in my everyday life it ain't always glitz and glamour you know what i'm saying i'm I'm a little tomboy, you know, you will see, you will see. So if you want to see how that whole process is, me talking and doing what I got to do, then you can always go to that channel. Um, probably, hopefully, I can start tomorrow. But um, yeah, that's what's going on with me. I don't want to go to, y'all know I talk way too much. But I love all of you. And um, since I have a lot of places to go and things to do, you'll probably see more makeup tutorials from me. You know, I do have meetings and things that I need to um, attend and I need to have a nice face. For the month of January, this is the third time I actually had makeup on. I've been going around naked. My face has been naked because um, I've been busy. I've been on the grind, y'all. On the computer, you know, getting everything done. Um, out there you know picking out paint swatches and all of that and it can be very stressful my husband's not here to kind of like eh, you know to kind of like just keep me level-headed you know say hey you tripping so he'll be home soon so i'm so excited about that and then y'all can see how we are together because we are the craziest couple but gotta go i'll see you guys later i got to go cook dinner for the kids for they kill me bye